Now let us see how to assign a CS area to plant. We need to assign a CS area to plant so that we can make it as a plant that can supply goods to customers. This is the final step uh, in uh, defining uh, SD organization objects. We have to do that under here. Enterprise structure. Let me close this. Enterprise structure assignment. Sales and distribution. Assign sales organization distribution channel to plant. Execute that. Create a new entry. Choose our sales organization. In New York distribution channel retail and the plant is New York sorry not this one New York data has been saved okay you can see here the entry that we added just now is saved here similarly we have to also do it for plant uh, uh, Washington and sales organization Washington but I will not do that because I would like to show you the difference if I don't do I don't do the assignment of sales organization to a plant what will be the implication the implication will be when we come to assign shipping points to plants we will not be able to assign the shipping points to plants I'll explain to you what is shipping point and so forth later on but for now I just want to leave the setup of uh, Washington plan on purpose so that when we come to this stage here assignment or shipping point to plant we will not be able to see our uh, Washington uh, plant in this list let me show you this is where we assign our shipping points to plants you will be able to see New York here this is plant and then this is a shipping point the node the upper node is a uh, plant the lower node is actually shipping point so here I will show you the New York plant appearing here because we have already set up or in other words we have already assigned a sales area to this plant but for uh, Washington warehouse we have not assigned it yet so that's why it's not appearing here this is because only plants which are assigned to a sales area will be shown in this list here shipping points assignment because any other plants which is not assigned to sales area means that it is not associated with any sales functions so that plant probably is purely for production purposes and no goods will be shipped from that plant to any customers so this is the difference that I am trying to show you so it is important that we assign a sales area to a plant so that the plant is recognized as a, as a, a place where goods can be shipped to customers from this plant.